falling out of the sky. That's unfortunate. She's in the aether. Yes. Yeah. He's communing with the darkness. Yeah. Go towards the light! I've seen this episode before, don't do it. Oh. It got much darker than I expected. Hello, masked friend. Hear, feel, think. Oh good, subtitles, this is helpful. By light. Living the dream. White versus black magic. Yeah, da, 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 da. Swingy swag, what's in the bag? This staff. Can't help but think of the, the little thing that was going around Tumblr. Y'all want to hop on this dick so bad. <laughs> Y'all want to hop on the motherfucking payload. Boy, who's talking to me? It's not Gabriel. I'm going to be disappointed. Spoiler alert, it's not. Y'all right, lass? Oh my goodness. Is it Reinhardt? Oh, it's not even Reinhardt. You were moaning in your slit with sweat and buckets besides. Wow, you were watching me sleep? That's not creepy. That'll be the Aether, I reckon. Some are more prone to the sickness than others. No need to oh, fret, good. Though. I'm You'll sick. soon get used to it. Embrace death. Oh, good. He's an alcoholic. <laughs> I can tell. It takes a special kind of person to wear earrings like that. Party. Party hardy. <laughs> oh, move on. Yeah, that would drive me to drink, too. Pass the bottle. Feeling better, Koopo? Oh, right. They have the, like, uh -huh. the Asian... You can see like, us. Everything. I had a feeling you could, Koopo. We're Moogles, and we live in this wood. Please blow my brains out. <laughs> oh, good. The drunkard can dr see them, too. Normal folks can't see us or hear us, which makes you special, Koopo. Oh, good. Give me a helmet. Put These me on two the are short. actually really important to the story. Oh, good. And seeing as how you're special, maybe you can tell us something. I don't know, Jack Diddley. The woods been rest restless of late. Lots of strange things happening. Have you chance to witness anything suspicious, Koopo? I took too strong of a dose of the peyote. Oh my god! <laughs> but of course you haven't. You've only just arrived. Can't tell me what to do, Moogle. Well, there's Sorry. nothing for it, then. We'll just have to keep looking. Nice to meet you, Koopo. Oh, peace out, nerd. Her little tail. Uh, head tumors. When your hair is capable of growing tumors. He's like, oh, my drink's empty. That's disappointing. That's what happens when you drink too much. Your is a fair way off, in case you were wondering, seeing as you're awake. How's about you keep <laughs> me company till we get there? You gonna buy me dinner first? Them youngins don't much care for conversation, see. I can tell. So you're such a quality conversationalist. Fremont's the name, and Petlin's betrayed. Oh, oh, hallelujah, you have a name. 
As for your good self, judging by your unusual garments, I'd say you are one of them new adventures. It makes me uncomfortable you're looking me up and down like that. I knew it! Going wherever the wind blows, sinking fortune and glory. Now that's what I call living. So long as oh, you can of... avoid dying, I mean. Ain't oh no my god. That adventure is a risk of business these days, especially. That sounded like a the... threat. <laughs> what was it that first attracted you to it? Oh good, do I get to answer a question? Yes. Why did you become an adventurer, Angela? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> that's a good answer. I dig that one. <laughs> Uh, oh, it's really an answer. Okay. Is uh, that your final answer? Is that what you're locking in with? Oh. Uh. I guess to gain power. Like, to if win I had to pick glory. One... That sounds oh, like yes. Reinhardt. To win glory! Glorious battle. <laughs> to gain power, then? Yeah, why not? Let's see. Oh, I talk. Good. Oh, it's pa chocobo powered. Good. <laughs> power, as in, er, power to do good, like protecting yes. the weak and fighting for what's right and all that. Aye, I thought that's what you meant. Well, adventuring adventurers do get up to a lot of fighting, that's for sure. You'll never be short of a chance to polish your war Warcraft and the adventuring business. I'm a pacifist. Wait. I'm not actually here for Warcraft. <laughs> when you arrive in town, you best enroll at the Adventurers Guild. They're set. They'll set you on the right path. And it wouldn't Shouldn't hurt tell to join a guild, what? neither. Tell me what to do a lot. is home to a few, so if you fancy learn how to fight with a bow, a pull arm, or even spells, you should think about seeking one out. How many bottles have you gone through since we started this? <laughs> Just remember, though, there's more important things than fortune and glory. Such as breathing. Ain't no profit being dead. And that's a fact. Yeah, with the amount of drinking you do, you'll probably vomit and aspirate. So, enjoy suffocating to death. Whoa! Halt! What happened? Go to no further! <laughs> that looks like severe facial trauma. What's this, then? Was he born that way? Ha! <laughs> GG. You wanna what? fight? What's going on? A skirmish has broken out up ahead with the... Fuck you. For your own safety, you must remain here until... You get shot in the face, please. Take that helmet off right off. Oh, look at these nerds. They all have the terrible mask. That's got Bloody it. Bloody hells! We shall hold them here. Try to break clear. That rhymes. They're smart enough to block. Oh wow, quality! I'm like, I know some weeby well, magic. Well, you guys to took them this. down so easily, and you couldn't have done that before stopping us. <laughs> couldn't have just solved the problem. That was too bleeding close. Joking aside, this won't be the last time you meet those feathered feet, so just you take care, alright? I try not to take advice from an alcoholic. By the by, is this your first trip to Gritania? What was your first clue? Yes. Why not as cute? Oh man, this is... <laughs> I hope you don't give me a play-by-play. -play. Of course you are. That's why you should have said cool. no. My bad. Ah, uh, at long last. Behold, Gredania, the forest nation blessed by the elementals. It's been hitting too much peyote. <laughs> Smoke weed ever died.
The ancient black shroud. The ancient forest close to the heart of Eorzea. I don't know how to say that. Eorzea. Beneath the boughs of its towering trees lies the woodland city. Beneath the boughs of its towering trees lies the woodland city state of Gridania. 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 Yes. Roll your. Once a, sanctuary from the world Once a sanctuary the hedge, from the world beyond the hedge, even the mighty, even the mighty elementals, elementals, eternal guardians of the forest, of the could forest, not forestall the coming of the seventh umbral era. Well, that sounds like a drag. Era. Get it, because a dragon caused it. <laughs> <laughs> goddess Nofica However, the goddess Nofica was never one to forsake her children. Today, she, her children. Welcomes today she welcomes another brave soul. Brave soul. Oh, good. Glad I'm welcome. Welcome, welcome, Sabbath Moon. A telling role in the tale of oh, good. Realm. I might have a dramatic impact. Alright, we. Good. And here's where we part ways, lass. I'm Consider off to the markets to deliver me wares, then it's back to the high road for me. Should probably consider joining Alcoholics Anonymous. You've got a problem. Here, I want you to have this. By way of thanks for keeping me company. Are you giving me money? I'm not a whore. Wow. Hey, you never yeah. did tell me your name, did you? Well, here's an idea. Become the sort of storied personage I can brag about having met, and I'll consider a square. I never want to see you again. I actually don't think you do, so... Oh good, peace out, nerd. Her to her bosom, that she may Angela just turns like, PEACE OUT, NERD! <laughs> and in her heart, so serenity, purity... Mm. Serenity sounds sanctity. good. Purity, okay. Sanctity, alright. This whole religious nonsense sounds like a problem, but we can work with that. Final Fantasy. Fourteen. First, I thought it said 15, and I'm like, wait a minute. What's with the line in the middle? <laughs> okay. And here we are. Why am I still awake? city it is. That it is. The music here actually sounds like The Hobbit from the Shire. Oh good. You there! Yes, Ooh. you! Oh god, more Moogles? No. Thank god, no. Your face is not known to me! <laughs> Nearly come to the city, no doubt! But the rest of me is known to you? Like, what? I am Bertinet, a word whaler of Gridania. That's a terrible name. It is my duty to protect our nation from our enemies while welcoming those who may yet prove her friends. Let us see what you are. Take the mask off and maybe we can talk. <laughs> Punch him in his dick. Yeah. <laughs> Swift knee. Oh good, more quests. Another green adventurer, I presume. Not as green I as you. As much. <laughs> we cannot allow strangers to wander Gridania unchecked and untested. Jokes on you, asshole. It's a free country. Before you rush off and begin pestering every second citizen for work, I suggest you make yourself known at the Caroline Canopy, that's the headquarters of the local adventurers guild, in case you were wondering. I wasn't. The Caroline Canopy is the building you see behind me. Speak to mother fuck you with them <laughs> and she will take you in hand. What of me is she going to take in hand? That sounds like assault. 
Oh, good. And that building wasn't actually behind you. It was the, the cliff face that was behind you. You're a lying sack. But I'm a sucker for a quest, that's for sure. Mother Moan. <sighs> okay, Mother Moan, what do you have to say? young adventure come to put your name down in the guild, I assume? I'd really rather not. Welcome. Mjoln's my name or mother, as most call me, and the Carolyn Canopy is my place. I'm glad that, you know, you're a woman and own a place. As the head of the Adventurer's Guild in Grudania, I have the honor of... Providing guidance to the fledgling heroes who pass through our gates. No matter your ambitions, the guild is here to help you attain them. I'm glad you're not a racist. <laughs> In return, we expect you to fulfill your duties as an adventurer by assisting the people of Gridania. A fine deal, wouldn't you agree? You expect me to do things? To an outsider's eyes, all may seem well with our nation, but not could be further from the truth. The people live in a state of constant apprehension. I think that's true of every country. Uh, Look at that. You can jump hey. through this if you want. Yeah, he's a out peace nerd. How silly you for wanting to be the narrator. Yet amidst the hazy recollection and conflicting accounts all agree on one thing, that Eorzea was saved from certain doom by a band of valiant adventurers. If Whatever one of them wasn't the real Ray is, I'm going to be disappointed. Whatever else we've misremembered, none of us have forgotten the heroes who risked life and limb for the sake of the realm. And yet, whenever we try to say their names... Word dies upon our lips. Because he's called Reaper now. <laughs> and whenever we try to call their faces to mind, we see not but silhouettes amidst a blinding glare. That, that might be signs of a tumor. You should get that looked at. <laughs> Thus have these adventures come to be known as the, the Warriors of Light. I love melanomas. Ahem. <clears throat> Pray do not feel daunted by the deeds of legends. We do not ask that you become another warrior of light, only that you do what you can to assist the people of Gridania. So in other words, your expectations for me are low. Great or small, every contribution counts. I trust you will play your part. Every community needs a ditch digger. All that's left, then, is to conclude the business of registration. Here's a quill. Scroll your name right there. Oh, and I would appreciate if you used your real name. There is a special place in the seventh hell for those who use amusing aliases. You mean I can't write mercy? That's rude. Ziegler, Angela, hmm? And you're quite sure this isn't an amusing alias? Wow, are you mocking my name? Very well. From this mo moment forward, you are a registered adventurer of Kodanya, nation blessed of the elements, elementals, and the bounty of the Twelve's Woods. The guild expects great things from you. Look at what just arrived, another god's damned adventurer. Wow, the contempt is unreal. Don't you start with that. Adventurers are the very cell that Kodanya needs. The elder seeds here herself bade us welcome them with open arms. Do you mean to disregard her will? 
Not the asshole squad. Of course not. Lest you forget, it is my sworn duty to uphold the peace. Am I to blame if outsiders bring mistrust upon, upon themselves? You, adventurer, mind that you do not cause any trouble here, or I shall personally cast you out of this realm and into the seventh hell. Suck my dick. Ahem. <laughs> <clears throat> Pay that outburst. No mind. He meant only that. Consul, you. Suspicious characters have been prowling the trolls' words of late, you see, and the word wellers feel they cannot afford to take any chances. Yeah, well, when you let every Tom, Dick, and Harry in here. As is often the way with folk who live in isolation, Gridanians, uh, won't mistrust things they do not well know, your good self included. Fear not, however! Given a catalogue of exemplary deeds in no more than a handful of years, the locals will surely warm up to you. <laughs> I have several years and a whole bunch of bullshit tasks to do before they're okay with me. On behalf of my fellow citizens, I welcome you to Gridania. May you come to consider, consider our nation as your own in time. And this is why my people don't leave. Now then, you may depend on Mother to teach you a few things that every adventurer should know. Have you even been outside? I don't think she leaves the inn. Oh, good. She's there day and night. Quality. I had a dungeon master who all of his innkeepers and, like, barkeeps were, like, ex-adventurers, so they were all, like, ten times the level that we were, and would annihilate us when we would start bar fights. Let us begin at the beginning, shall we? Now that you're a formal member of the Adventurers Guild, we must be sure you have a firm grasp of what the fundamentals of adventuring... I've played Call of Duty, I know how this goes. <laughs> to that end, I have three tasks I wish you to perform. Your first task is to visit the Aetherite. This massive crystal stands in the middle of the Aetherite Plaza, not far from the Caroline Canopy. You want me to look at a rock? As a device that enables instantaneous transportation, the Aetherite plays a key role in the life of every wandering adventurer. Once so a super-powered rock. Once you have located Good. the crystal, all you need to do is touch its surface. A member of the word willers will be present to offer further They hate my guts, we just established that. For your second task, you are to visit the Conjurer's Guild. You can't tell me what to do, lady. There is no better place to learn the arts of conjury. Speak with Medla, fuck you. <laughs> and she will explain the benefits of joining the guild. Man, I have to join all the guilds in town, huh? For your third and final task, I would have you visit the markets at the heart of Old Gridania's commercial district. There you shall find weapons, armor, and all the various items that an adventurer might need on her travels. There Good. is, however... Find a big bottle of Tylenol to OD on. There is, however, more to the markets than buying and selling goods. Speak with... Percy Montret. Percy... <laughs> And listen well to his counsel. Oh, good. The master merchant can be uncooperative at times, so be sure to offer him one of my famous eel pies. That sounds awful. Like so many men, he is much more charitable when his stomach is full. Here, have a batch not long ago. That's strangely convenient, lady. I have your ta- you have your tasks, Ziegler. No. Mate, no fucking English. Ah, oh, and one more thing. Should you happen to come across a ci any citizens in need, don't be afraid to proffer a helping hand. I am certain they will be pleased to meet an adventurer in whom they can confide their woes. I just got yelled at for, like, wanting to talk to people. Now you want me to talk to people? Granted, the work they offer is unlikely to be of realm-shattering importance, but prove your worth and build a reputation, and in time, folk will be more inclined to entrust you with matters of moment. Oh, so this is the years of, like, stupid behavior that you wanted before I can be trusted. Awesome. Quality. 
lady. Digging that man skirt. I also suggest that you lend an ear to the smith here in the canopy. The smiths are trusted representatives of the Adventurers Guild and are an invaluable source of advice for neophyte heroes seeking to attain greatness. Oh, good. If we all follow the same path, then we can all be great together. Just like everyone else. The amount of green in this place. It's very, uh, sick looking. It's just very strange to me because where I'm from it is very brown and dead because we have no water. No water. Hysteria days, hysteria doll. Oh, aren't you too cute? Together, forever. Why does it say RP next to my name? Role play. Uh. Hey look, a quest giver. Fuck him. Or her. The tuning. I should probably get some hand sanitizer. Everybody else has touched that rock too. Oh god, my rock should not talk to me. I see you're faithfully following Mother's instructions. Why is everybody following me around? This is creepy. Allow me to offer you a bit of instruction myself. This is unsolicited. I am Nysia of the Wood Whalers, and I know a thing or two about the Aetherite. Yes, that big crystal right there. Nobody asked you, though. Aetherites are devices that trap into ethereal energies and are primarily used as a means to travel swiftly from one place to another. Yeah, I didn't suffer severe head trauma on my way here. I've seen these back home. Return and teleport the most common transportation spells. Make direct use of the Aetherites and their connection to the flow of Aether. And as these devices are found in almost every corner of Eorzea, any adventure worthy of the name will wish to seek out and tune herself to each one. It's like Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. Truly, few things in this world are so useful as an entropid explorer. Why does everybody wear those masks? But you need not locate them all at once. Before rushing into the wilds, I suggest you start with the Aetherites find found here in Gridania. Flawless advice. Should you wish to learn more about the Eighth Rider transportation magic, I am here to answer your questions. I never want to talk to you again. Most antisocial Angela ever. You were tuned with the Eighth Rider. You are now able to use the return spell. Oh, good. I'm not totally illiterate. <laughs> like, sometimes I feel like these games just assume that you're just dumb as rocks. Like, my character grew up in this world. She's not... not unaware. Actually, the Aras aren't from Aorcia. But at they're least this from... part. But they're, they, they exist in the universe. They know the, universe. the world, yes, but they don't, you know, know what's they're here in this world. Totally ignorant. Okay. By All what I... right does a fledgling adventurer presume to address master of the market. You're an asshole. You think you can stroll in here, bold as you please, and demand my hard-earned knowledge? Ha! A merchant does not for naught, especially when dealing with would-be heroes. Are you done stroking your dick? If, on the other hand, you had some tasty morsel to curry my favor, then I might reconsider your request. Talk shit, get hit. Come now, this whole encounter reeks of fuck you, handiwork, and more specifically her baking. Don't look so surprised, lass. I smelled that eel pie of yours a mulm away. Hand it over. Ugh. That mustache. Mmm, that flaky crust. Just divine. Very well. I'm a man of my word. Pay, 
pay close attention, for I shall only explain this once. The aspiring adventurer need look no further than the Rosewood and Ebony stalls. Both are but a short stroll from where we stand. If you mean to do battle, you'd best be prepared with a quality set of weapons and armor. I don't got money, dude. And I'm not blowing you. <laughs> Such goods are the province of Rosewood stalls, directly south of here. You will be pleased to learn that the merchants of Gridania are exceedingly particular when it comes to craftsmanship, so you needn't fear defective straps and the like. Kinky. If it is potions in... Paraphernalia. Goddamn. Words, why? English, it's late. Head north to the ebony stalls. The shelves, these are lavishly stocked by widely traveled little dolls and merchants, and I may truly say that I have seen things amongst their myriad wares and I scarce knew existed. I hear a ship merchant. Do you follow me thus far? The first step in any purchase is to select the stalls that meet your needs, then you may concern yourself with price and profit. There's little more I can teach you with mere words. Go pers peruse. God damn, I can't read. Go peruse the stalls and see for yourself what wares they offer. There is no substitute for first-hand experience. After all, I am wary of talking. Unless you have another eel pie. Let me go snort some cocaine off of a mirror. Look at this. Look at that chick. Look at the sky. Wasn't it like sunshiny like not even ten minutes ago? Night travels fast. Apparently. For a second I thought it said you have ethernet and I'm like what? No it did say that. I'm not. Wow what? <laughs> you now have access <laughs> to ethernet. Oh my god. Which, of course, reminds me of the comic about Genji talking about how he wants to be connected to the internet. Oh, hey, the Halloween event's here. Oh, I good! I, I, could, I could do the thingy thing, but I have to be level 15, so... Yeah, no worries. Talk to the little doobly-doobly. Doobly-doobly. Attuning to the rock! Seriously though, I got some hand sanitizer. I'm gonna catch something. 